I am Anil Kumar and in this video we are going to discuss transformation of circle. g of x is x square plus y square equals to 16 and r of x is transformed relation for g of x which is 2 times g of 2x. Discuss the transformation and sketch the relation r of x. So let us first sketch g of x which is a circle x square plus y square equals to 16. So that is a circle with radius of 4 units, right? It is x square plus y square equals to 4 square. So g of x is actually not a function, just a relation, right? It is a relation where every point is equidistant from the center and it is 4 units away. So that forms a circle. So this is, let us say, g of x. So I've drawn g of x, where x and y intercepts are plus and minus 4. These are the intercepts. Now what we need to sketch is r of x. r of x is 2 times g of 2x. Now. Can you explain these transformations? What is the meaning of this two and what is the meaning of this two? Let's begin with the two outside. It means vertical stretch, right? By factor of two. The other two which is inside the brackets represents horizontal what? Stretch or compression? compression of half, right? So that is horizontal compression by a factor of half. Now knowing this, we can actually sketch R of x. So the relation R of x, it is a relation since it fails vertical line test, right? Vertical stretch means every point is stretched vertically by a factor of 2. If I multiply 0 by 2, you get 0. But if I multiply 4 by 2, you get 8. Let's say this is 8. Minus 4 by 2 is minus 8. And these points remain. They are invariant. So let's connect these points and then draw a circle. So it is now an ellipse, which is kind of like this, right? So, okay, let's, let's go like this. Okay, that's not that good, but in any case, I think... You understand what I'm trying to do, right? So it should have been more like this, right? Anyway, this is half done. Now let's do compression by a factor of half. That means this point will move to minus 2 and the other will move to plus 2. 0 times half is 0. So it remains, the x value remains 0, right? The y value will of course be 4. We are just changing horizontal points. So that will give you the graph as kind of like this, right? Now, so you can join these points with a smooth curve and that is what you get. So this function which you get now is r of x, right? It is r of x. So g of 2x times 2 times g of 2x. So that is how you can sketch transformed circle, right? And I hope you appreciate how to do vertical stretch and horizontal compression. Thank you.